Hello, my name is Caleb, and today we're going to learn a bit more about Google Circles. Well, Google Circles are similar to adding people on Facebook or following them on Twitter. And I just wanted to say that circles are all the same, and none of them are, uh, they're just for organization. Now, to edit your circles, you want to select the circles icon on the top of the home page. From here, you can add people to your circles by dragging them, or by dragging them from other circles, or by searching their name and dragging them to a circle. Simple as that. And you can also open a circle and search to find the people who are in the circle. Another way to see who's in circles is to hover over them, and it'll the, three, the circles that they're in will glow. If you want to create a new circle, you can select this circle to the left of the screen that says create circle. Yeah, who would have guessed, right? <laughs> and then from here, you can describe the circle. Awesome people. Yeah, that's, that's what I want to name it. Then you can add a new person. I'll just use Ray William Johnson because it's pretty gnarly. Then you can create the circle. Simple as that. Now that the circle is made, it should show up below the rest of your circles, or beside them, depending on uh, how many circles you have. You can also delete circles by selecting the circle and clicking delete this circle. But be warned, if you delete it, all the people inside of it who are not in other circles will also be deleted, and any post shared to these circles will no longer be able to be seen. Some of this is pretty simple, but I'm just trying to show you the main methods of organizing your circles and optimizing Google Plus's uses. Now that you know a bit about circles, you're probably wondering, well, what do they even do? Well, if you go to the home page, you can see on the side there is a stream. This you can select stream just from certain uh, circles, like friends. And then anybody in my friend circle will show up in the stream, which I'm pretty sure they're all the same for me. <laughs> yeah, that's a bit different. Incoming is people who have you in their circles, but you don't have them in yours. And notifications, um, it shows, uh, what's it called? Oh yeah, notifications. Yeah, it'll show them. And you can also organize your chat by selecting this little downward arrow across from chat and collect, uh, clicking circles. Dang, here we go. And then you can choose which circles you want to show up in chat. And then you can talk to them. But nobody's on for me because... I don't have any friends. Sucks. Guess I'll just get used to it. So this will really help make um, Google Plus organized. And yeah. This was made when Google Plus was pretty new and I may make some updated versions for some of my Google Plus videos if necessary. So if I do, there'll be a, dis um, a link in the description. Thank you. Be sure to subscribe and add me on Google Plus. Bye.